it is a my naked Triumph Daytona and of course you've got these induction pipes but I'm not happy with them being open like that um, so I'm gonna, I've got a bit of aluminium grating and I'm going to it's quite easy to install because there's a little lip there so you've got a space kind of in, in there to put something um, so I'm just going to get on with measuring it and fit in a couple of circles of aluminium uh, it's vent cover, you know the, the vent covers you get for the the boy racers use it so I'm get on with that so here I've got the grate here and I've measured the kind of vent I don't know what you call it, mesh. That's what I googled, mesh. So I know the diameter is 46.5. Okay, and then I measured the actual, I don't know if you can see that on the, I'll put a black mark on that little pick. Just bought this pick today. I don't know if you can see that very well. Well, to the edge of the black mark is the, is the depth of the cavity. So if I measure that, I want it to be a nice snug fit. And let's have a look. Let's have a look. So that is... I say two mil, so you add four mil onto that. Okay, so it's 50.5 mil. That's the diameter. 50, say 50 millimetres, that'll be close enough. Okay, so we need to get the, the radius of it, uh, the circumference. So the circumference is pi r squared, isn't it? Let's put uh, Google up. I've got the laptop going here. Just find out. Um, I'll get the little camera going, see if I can film it. I don't know if his lights are too bright and getting... I'll just film it with a handheld, see if I can... I'll just film it with a handheld, see if I can do that somehow uh, without getting any glare. I think I'm getting lots and lots and lots of glare. Um, I don't know how we do that. Come off circle. I'd give me a little get rid of all these things. What's this? How to get rid of them? Um, two pi r. I'm just looking for a little um, something to help me. Get rid of these things, how to get rid of that, that's it. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. I need to put this camera down somewhere. I'll find somewhere I'll put this camera on. Uh, what can I use? Let's have a look. Something tall. Let's have a look. What have I got? Tall and thin. Few seconds. Ah, there we go. Hopefully that'll be tall and thin enough. You can see what's going on. I hope. Okay. Be better if I turn that light off, maybe. Okay. Right, I want to I'll enter value. Okay, radius. Um, I'll put the diameter because I know the diameter. Um, D equals 2R. Uh -huh. So 
circumference. The radius is half the diameter, isn't it? Right, so it's 25. Circumference equals 157.08. Okay, 157. So the circumference equals 157 millimeters. Okay, turn this off now. <clears throat> Why I'm saying that is because I've got this bit of cable that I'm going to cut down the middle and use in a circle to go round the, the grate. Okay. But let's get the bit of aluminium out. A bit of get rid of that. Don't need that anymore. Put that to one side. Okay, that's it. That's all it is. Very simple. And I just want to cut a couple of holes in that. Yeah. Which need to be a 50mm diameter. I want to draw something. I'll use this cardboard, I'll, I'll make a circle out of this cardboard. I need uh, 50 centimeters across. Um, how am I going to do that? I don't think I have anything to make a circle with. Might there be a way of doing it? Eh? With a marker pen and get rid of that circle. So I'm getting it dead on. This will just give me a bit of peace of mind that there's nothing massive going into the engine, into the air box, you know, really big bits. I mean, it's not, it's not got any mesh on it from the factory, Triumph haven't got any mesh on it, but there is quite a lot of tubing between the fairing and the actual air box before it gets to where I'm putting the cut these covers over. That can go on the inside, that's really messy that bit. Okay, I'll get this in here. I will glue it just for extra, just for peace of mind, you know. Um, that should hopefully go all the way around if I've done my sums right. Should do, it looks about right. Fiddly work. I don't think there's anything that isn't fiddly. Sleeping is not fiddly, I don't think. Being awake is fiddly. <laughs> right, probably better glue in this, just see if it fits all the way around. I don't think it's gonna. I've maybe cut it wrong, this uh, disc. Kill, but there you go. Let's see if that fits on the bike now. 
put them bits on the inside. Okay, I'll go and pop that on. What I ended up doing... Look. Um, I ended up putting a bit of wire and wrapping it round on the inside, gluing it in with a super glue, which you have to sit for ages. But it's a good 30 seconds to a minute you have to press before it'll stick. Then putting a bit of mesh in, it's about to rain now. And then putting this, so it's just sandwiched the mesh in between. I super, glued, I super glued the mesh in and then I super glued this on just to be 100% sure. But that's it. And I'm going to get in because it's raining. And that's the other side as well. Yeah, smarter. Huh? 